Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's morning English. This is Colin. Hello, everybody. This is Summer. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。Summer, I've got a question for you.、Mm-hmm. Do you want to be rich? <laughs> All right. I think I'm already rich in my intelligence and beauty. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, sure. I think people won't say no to being a rich man or a rich woman. So, what about you? You have to dream big.、Uh-huh. I want to be very rich. I want to have robots as my assistants. You have that already. You have Siri. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, this question is related to what we'll be talking about today. Robots? No, <laughs> it's the other thing. Being rich. Let's talk about expressions about being rich. Okay. So, 呢，我们今天啊，就来讲讲有钱这些表达。因为提到有钱，大家是不是都能想到 rich？ 所以，我们今天要来看呢，说一个人有钱，除了用这个 rich， 还能用到哪些实用啊、好玩的表达 ？Okay. So, the word rich is an adjective, right? And it has many synonyms that are worth learning. Yeah, synonyms 就是同义词。那么想到这个 rich， 它的同义词，大家知道有哪些吗 ？Now, I think many students know the word wealthy. Yeah. Yeah, the noun is wealth. The adjective is wealthy. So we can say he possesses a lot of wealth. He is wealthy. 对 ，wealthy 就是富有的嘛。Then we can also use this word, well off. Oh yeah, I like this word. Any particular reason? Well, it, you know, it's it's kind of low key.、Uh, if you don't know the word, you might think it、uh, it's talking about health or something.、Mm-hmm. Uh, but it means to have a lot of money. Ah,、uh, yeah, well off. 意思也是富有的 And I also like this word. 和我们前面刚刚讲这个 rich 还有 wealthy 相比呢，就是 well off 这个词给人感觉就很舒服，没有那种暴发户的感觉。You know, it's not like someone who strikes a rich. Exactly. You just said, "Strike it rich." This is also a very useful expression. Yeah, strike 就是打击、碰撞那个单词，动作是非常突然的，就特别快。So strike it rich means you made a lot of money very suddenly. 对，我们常说暴发户嘛，就是一下就发财了。所以这个词就是 strike it rich。但是我们刚刚讲这个 well off 就没有暴发户这个意思，会更低调一些。And you can see in here that this word is used quite often. Like、um, when we talk about the rich and the poor, we can say people from well-off families. 哎，对对，而且这个 well-off 还可以用在对比的时候。比如你说一个人没有另一个人那么有钱，你可能会说 he's less rich， 但是太直接了，所以你就可以换成 he's less well-off. Now a similar word to this is well-to-do. Oh yeah, well-to-do. 这个词可以和 well-off 一起来记。而且注意，这两个词都是合成的形容词。然后呢，这个 well 和 of 中间有个连字符。Well to do 这个词中间有两个连字符。Now there's another word that's often used, loaded. Yeah, this word has its own picture. Load 就是重量、负重，对吧？<笑>那你那如果一个人身上钱沉甸甸的，那就是 loaded， 所以就是很有钱。<笑> Now note that this is not a formal word, so you know don't use this in any of your formal writing. Got it. And I also like another expression that's have money to burn. Yeah, if you have money to burn, you either have a crazy mind or really deep pockets. <笑> yeah， 就是你钱多的烧得慌，对吧？然后我刚刚还发现，真的有好多表示这个钱多的表达，比如刚刚 Colin 就用到了 deep pocket. Well, if your pocket is very deep, you can put a lot of money in it. So we say rich people have deep pockets. 对，这里注意一下，中文里我们说钱包鼓鼓的，英文里呢说口袋深深的，然后就是有钱。所以可能外国人通常把钱是放口袋的。<laughs> All right, and you know, to be rich, there are also many different ways. What do you mean? Well, for example, you can be wealthy from really hard work,、um, maybe saving a lot.、Mm-hmm. Uh, I mean, you can work your way up to being rich. Yeah, 就是比较朴实的，通过工作来赚钱。What else? 
Well, you could get money very fast, like win a lottery.、Uh, like we said, strike it rich. Ah, I got it. So there are many different types of being rich. 就是有钱人有不同类型，有朴实型，有暴发户型。那还有一种就是继承家业，也是我们平常常说的，就是家里有矿要去继承。矿 ？What is that? <laughs> you know, that's just an expression. Quan means a mine, like a coal mine. People who own a mine are considered to be very wealthy. So if you have a mine to inherit, then you're from a well-off family.、Oh, I see, I see.、Uh, in English, we would often say inherit a fortune. Ah, 继承一大笔钱 Fortune means a lot of money. But this way of being rich depends entirely on your family. Yeah. Another saying we use here is "born with a silver spoon in your mouth." Born with a silver spoon in your mouth, 大家听出来这个表达是什么意思了吗？和中文中我们常说的一个表达是完美对应的，就是含着这个金汤匙出生。But why is it silver in English and gold in Chinese?、Uh, I don't know. I, I think maybe because Chinese people like gold more than silver, so they change it to gold spoon instead. Yeah, I think so. So, do you know anybody who's born with a silver spoon in the mouth? Mm, I know those in the royal family are definitely born with a silver spoon. Yeah, good example. 皇室嘛，那就是金汤匙的代表。那他们就绝对不是土豪。哎，我们既然讲到土豪这个词啊，那要讲一讲。How would you say 土豪 in English? 土豪 No, no, I mean the English. This is the English. The word is from Chinese, and it doesn't have or doesn't need an English translation. Ah, so this 土豪就跟我们平常说大妈是一样的。直接用拼音就可以表达它的英文了，就是大妈、土豪。<laughs> but the concept of 土豪 exists in English. It means people who strike it rich, but don't know how to live rich,、uh, behave.、Uh, that's to say, to have some kind of class. Ah, I know. In English, there's new money and old money. So 土豪 means people who have new money, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's a there's a phrase for that. The nouveau rich, it means new rich. Nouveau rich, 就是这是个法语词吧 ？Yeah, exactly. 然后它就跟对应来的英文呢，就是 new rich， 指的就是新贵之人，也就是暴发户了。<laughs> right. 所以我们今天就是不仅学到了英文啊，还学到了法语。We also learn French. Yeah, yeah. It's very common in Britain to say nouveau rich. Nouveau rich, yeah. So. Learning something new can make you happier than making money. You know, they both can make me happy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for listening. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。This is Rich Colin. <laughs> All right, this is Summer who wishes to have money to burn. See you next time, guys. <laughs>